All right, kind of running around with our heads cut off this morning a little bit. Not really sure what jacket I want. I have a bigger one in the car. My hair, not done yet. My makeup, not done yet. I am planning on going out with Jason tonight, but, and I wanted to have my hair all the way done, my makeup all the way done, to run a few errands this morning, or actually this afternoon. Wasn't planning on leaving, <laughs> but Ashley still has hives. So I've had her stay home this morning, and the hives are now gone, so she can go to school. But, just as she was like, okay, I think I can go. I was like, okay, you let me know when you're all ready for school, and I will just stop where I'm at, and I will take you to school. So we were to that point, and Abby called me from the high school, and yep, you guessed it, the Honda is dead. So now, I have to, oh, I don't have Kaylee's key. Can you run up and get me Kaylee's key? What, is there one in here? So now I have to take, there's, that's a Honda. I have to take, can you run upstairs, yeah. Kaylee? Okay, can you she has, my then? yeah, I can watch your water. So I have to take Kaylee's key, car. Here, I'll do this. Okay, you take the lid off. I can't get the lid off. Go get the key from Kaylee. Go get the key from Kaylee. Um, we have to take Kaylee's car, because obviously my car can't jump start Abby's car, but Kaylee, was planning on going over to Jacob's with her car. So I have left her my Tesla key in case she's ready to go, but I'm not. I'm still stuck with Abby in a dead car. Jason is at a shoe show. I don't know if he should be done, actually. He should be able to come help us. So I need to call him. He doesn't even know this is happening because I didn't want to bother him. His last meeting was at 10 a.m. It's 11 a.m. <sighs> Buddy. Okay, she wants me to fill this up through the teeny tiny hole. Okay, I'm here to help Abby, but I can't get the car close enough because this car is parked next to her here at the little parking lot that she parks at. And this is the battery side right here. So they can't, I'm trying to run the cables down to Jason's, or to Kaylee's car down there. And the cable is like a couple feet short. So, Jason's on his way home. He is going to go, did I just lock myself out of this stupid car? I didn't lock it. Literally didn't lock it. Unlock. I didn't lock it. I didn't even like touch the fob. Anyway, Jason's going to go and get a specialized battery that he needs for this Honda, apparently, because um, we've already talked to O'Reilly's and the Honda dealership about it. And then he's going to go home, change his clothes, grab tools, and he will come back and um, change out the battery on that car. But meanwhile... We have another scenario where Abby needs Kaylee's car. It's not gonna, it's not gonna go over well. But, oh, I should have backed up for her. All right, it's been a couple hours. I uh, have been completely unproductive other than getting all the way ready. He went and found out where we can get the battery. Do they have the battery at the Big O Tire? She said they could take care of it. Okay. So now- I'm gonna double check with them because they say it takes special computer work and it's like you can do the computer programming for this kind of car right you asked her that i said yeah okay so yeah we can do this so i'm gonna ask it again and make sure okay so but the problem is the car is still dead at the parking lot by the high school so and there's someone parked next to abby still She's a sophomore, Abby knew her, and she has to stay in school all day, which doesn't get out for at least an hour. And so, it's kind of why we've been killing time, also because Abby was using Kaylee's car, the only car we have available to jumpstart the car, and to go and do her college classes. And so, she just got home. Kaylee is meeting us over at the high school. 
see if we have access to jump it. Otherwise, we go drop her off at Jacob's and get a portable jumper cable. I We had one we thought would work, and for whatever reason, the cable is not connecting to the battery charger pack. It's the only thing we ever had. <laughs> I don't know why it's not connecting. We got it from the Costco donations years ago. We did? Yeah, so that showed up. Maybe um, the kid came wrong or something, or someone swapped it, didn't realize they'd swapped it or something. Yeah, because I've used the power pack as like a like a charger. Which is great for that. Yeah, it's absolutely great for that. I got smaller ones because this one is really big. I like to keep it in the car just to, in case something happens. But anyway, so that's... <laughs> <laughs> this is our five. life. Car five. So hopefully we can jump it. If we can jump it, then we take it straight over to Big O Tires where a specialty battery gets to be installed. Um, and we likely let Abby use your car tonight for work. Take my car, take Ashley to the doctor. We still have to do that. She's surviving at school longer than I thought she would, um, which is good. If she can just go another hour and a half, she'll be able to get on the bus and come home and then I'll be able to take her to the doctor. And the nurse that said this morning, I haven't even had a chance to tell Jason yet. The nurse was like, yeah, after six plus days, yes, this is like a weird virus. It is, it is possible that's what it was, but it should have cleared up by now. It shouldn't be reoccurring every single day and as long as it's, you said it's occurring. So she said something else must be wrong. Um, so we'll go figure that out. Okay, Jacob just lent us these guys. Um, I can try and jump it with those because there's still someone because there's still someone parked next to Abby's car. Uh, All right, let's see if this works. The problem is you have to take off in order to get it to the. It says attach it to the negative and the positive. Right. Which well, the only way to get to that is to take all this off. No, it's not. You can. Okay. Well, I do it to a. I do it to that one right there. That one and that one. I don't ever take this off. I, I dumped the car before, honey. Here, let me get, separate them. Okay, get ready to start it. Go get in the car to start okay. it. Okay. Does it say it's ready for me to do it? I guess so. Nope. Okay, well, we missed the moment. It suddenly works because we suddenly got a ground to work. I held both buttons to force charge it. Okay, thank you. Take that back. We know to get one of these guys for both of their cars. This will be your birthday present, by the way. I need that. Yeah, I know. You'll need this in your car for future purposes, and you're free to go. Tell Jacob thank you. Yeah. Um, you are going home with this car, correct? Do you want to drive around with... Oh, no, you're taking it straight to Big O? Yeah. Okay. Okay. He is going to... Try not to show the license plate so I don't want to blur it. He's going to drive that car and meet me over at the tire place. Or, I don't know, whatever it's called. And Kaylee, she's heading out. Take, how many cars does it take to... <laughs> <laughs> jump start one car but yes Kaylee will be getting that um, starter kit um, so Abby will be too in this car so that well hopefully the new battery will not have this happen but you know just add a precaution they're becoming adults and you know don't need to constantly have mom and dad bail you out when we don't even have cars that can bail you out you have the cars that bail us out they literally have the cars to bail us out <laughs> We don't. Okay, let's go find out what's wrong with this squirt. <laughs> we also need to check her ears one more time. Right? Because one of them is kind of hurting again. So. As happens when you get to the doctor, you suddenly don't have as many hives. <laughs> Except for her. You have some, and we have, picture. yep, Kaylee sent us this picture from yesterday, right? Yeah, because I was telling her, she's like, 
I was showing her the hive and she's like, yeah, can I get a picture? This is so interesting. Like, she wanted to like... Well, she's very interested in like medical stuff. So. Yeah, but... Yep. We're kind of the last patient in here. Um, it's closing time. It's actually like closing time seven minutes ago. Kind of wondering if it's going to be one of those instances of they forgot we were in here. <laughs> The they nurses already come in and check her in, yeah. but um, not they hearing they come to like too much. They come into well, they're already yeah. like a half hour behind, which this they're not usually that late. So I'm gonna open the door and let's just do that really quick. Put your mask on when he comes back in. Just gonna check. Okay, all these people's like belongings are still at their desks. Um, there's just no one out there. Well, there's no one out there, but there's stuff like their jackets in there. Hopefully, their bags. Maybe they leave their jackets or their sweatshirts or something at, at their desk. But I don't know. We'll give it five it's more minutes, and then I'll. It's already found now. There was no one out there to say anything to. So, okay. I know. So we're just we're just sitting here. All right. No Not news. Contagious, Not contagious. I get up. It is the virus. It is probably going to run at course for another week or so. We were sitting in the parking lot waiting for her friends to join us. Yeah. We were kind of pending a little night play date um, based off this doctor's appointment, correct? But but we're good. Yeah. We're not contagious. It's her body reacting to this virus. I don't know how we would like if it's in my body, well, how would I Well, I just knew from my dad. Up. He would have told me, don't send her to school. Like, I would have known. <laughs> well, you did send me to school the other way. Yeah, I did. When you were fine, you were fine. Yeah, so, anyway, um, it could run a course for another week, and we're going to be okay yeah. with that, right? We're gonna, just going to deal with it. But what did we learn is probably the worst thing that you could do for the hives that you have been doing. That probably is making it worse. But I can't. I'm not doing it. You have to do it. I can. So heat makes it worse. No, and where I is can't. Ashley's? <laughs> where is Ashley's favorite place? I have a whole little like area around. Yeah, the fire. she has a little. No. Okay, can we just like turn off the fire? I just like to not have that's no because that's my heat. <laughs> You're not to hang out in your bed. No. Or your. Just, I. The playroom. The floor is just... My, my, your office. I know you like the floor. You're just going to have to not have the... You can't be near it. Maybe you just pull your blanket away from it. Anyway, he's like, yeah, that would make it flare pretty bad. So, um... But that's... Anyway. I was doing my hair when I got really But bad. she is doing all the right things, all the right medicine, was, at the right times. That makes sense. Because when it started, I was curling my hair. And that's heat can do it. Yeah, your heat on your ears. Hmm. <laughs> See, we're learning a little bit from this appointment. We didn't think of that. I was doing no. the ear thing with. Well, she didn't burn her ear. She just was using the curling iron hot by her ear, and then it kind of Ooh. flared up. And then it flared up behind my behind ear. your ears. And then it went down to. So we're gonna stay away from the fireplace. We are going to Maybe. keep doing the same medicine. Um. And if you stay away from the I fireplace, that's, that's um, crazy. yeah, that's probably going to be, yeah, if it's red, good. they have a red Tesla. Bougie. Yes. All right. Well, I'm going to put the camera away until Jason and I go on a date because it's about to get very, uh, Taylor noisy in here. Let's just say that. Yeah. All right. So you want to know where we're going? Yeah, I was like driving and then I was like, wait, I don't know where we're going. He hasn't told me. He's actually kept a secret. <laughs> he does not keep secrets and surprises, you guys. I don't even... Because surprising even, her is hard because you... No, you just don't send the Amazon package to the doorstep where I'm going to open all said Amazon packages. Okay, or turn you, right, turn right. So we are going to Wildfit. Yes. I, I don't know if that's like a Well, you told me off camera, something. and then I remembered we needed to film it, so. Yes, so. You guys are getting the second surprise <laughs> Great. attempt. You, you ruined the surprise there. But huh? I do, Wild Fin sounds so good right now. It's got some good variety of food. I'm going to get the, I'm already, you guys are already going to guess. Put it in the comments below. You're going to guess correctly. I'm going to get the fish and chips with the clam chatter. And clam maybe chowder a salad. It's really good. They do it's it good. so good. It's like one of the only places left in town 
that does a really good clam chowder. Oh yeah, Rogue our Brewery, Rogue Brewery, was, so Brewery was like my so favorite good. place for like cold, rainy day, and we would go during the it's fun to on just sit days and off. And yeah. Stuff. So I haven't found a good place. And no, Ivers is not good clam chowder. Sorry. Yeah. It's not. All right, well, um, I'm betting our, uh, I was thinking maybe we would be able to go to Costco and get the batteries for the car, the battery those. chargers. There's no hurry now. No, I know, but I figured I don't want to go home <laughs> until those girls are all home. We just dropped off four gaggly girls and they're all talking about Taylor. Taylor Swift, if you aren't in the know. No, they all have like these projects. They're all in the same class and they have this project at school for we their- We need a camera hold over here. Uh, can you just hold it? Cause I hold this thing all day long. You do, but you lean I... it. You lean it on the steering wheel and you lean it on something. No, I don't. Take I it and hold, hold it straight it. out like I just this. hold it. You're such a wuss. Okay, this is good. Come along for the nice little dinner. Okay, anyway. <laughs> no, it's just cute because they, they're doing like book reports or like topics or debates on different topics and um a whole bunch of ashley and her friends are all on talking about taylor swift and whether or not her albums are all only based off of her past boyfriends <laughs> well, and then a group of boys do you expect is doing it on kanye west and so there's like major like controversy within the group i don't know kanye west it based off his medication um reputation is all because of kanye west oh oh well, no, no, I'm talking about oh, Kanye West, West's music. I was wondering if it's based on No, 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 his, not his music, but what he did to her. At, on his meds or not. Whatever. Anyway, <laughs> you can join the boys in their little I'm making discussion. fun of Kanye West. I know, I know. He's I understand. Com sad, completely. But you're not like, understanding the, the controversy with okay. him. Well, okay, we'll catch up later. We're going to go, we're going to end our night. Because yep. there's nothing after this. If there's anything interesting after this, we'll, we'll bring you know. along. But there probably won't be. So. All right. <laughs> Good night, you guys. All right, really quick here. Thanks, Shane. Well, Jason did it good. He surprised he surprised me when I we went into the restaurant and uh, you know, I said, "Okay, we have a reservation," which he was thoughtful to get a reservation. And he says, "Yep, it's under the name Jason Brown." And she was like, "Oh, okay, great. Party of 8." And I was like, "Nope. Party of 2." And he just kept on walking. <laughs> And all of our friends were there. Yes. Thank you. And it's now nine o'clock. We've been there for two and a half hours. Had a great time. And uh, thank you. That was a great, good. great birthday night. And uh, of course, we had fish and oh. chips and donuts. So anyway, that's it. Take care. Good night. I forgot to tell you that they brought me some gifts. From this bag, this bag, and this yummy bag of chocolate covered Oreos, probably from Bowen's. Yep, from Bowen's Chocolate Factory. And then my friend Marla gave me this. This is from Carrie and Shane. It was very sweet of them because that's really, really good chocolate. Um, and then she gave me this nice candle with the, I love the top on it. I love that, so cute. And then she also gave me this. <laughs> she like gets everyone these now. They're electric um, uh, lighters, but you can charge them. So they never like, they never die. I mean, like, you can charge them so you can keep using them. And then my other friend, Sabrina, gave me the Waikiki Beach Coconut Soap. And I am not sharing that. That is going up into my bathroom at my sink. And um, that is, like, my all-time favorite scent. And they just know me very well. I love candles. I love the that scent. And I love chocolate. So, very sweet of them. 